Hey, welcome back to the channel. We have got something different today. We're gonna do a chainsaw comparison. Don't hardly ever do anything like this, but, so I was over at my, my good friend Bob's uh, Tratcher, Bob's Tratcher in McEwen, Tennessee, and I've been wanting a smaller saw for me. Tanya says it's hers, but uh, I really wanted a small saw because when we were delimbing this, you know, an arbor saw is really nice because they're so light. This is the Echo, uh, let me get you the number here. It's the Echo CS. 271T, so I know what I'm talking about. And this is the North America's lightest saw, and it is light, very light. So this is about $310 on Amazon, and you can, I tell you, you can probably go to your local dealer and maybe a little better price. I, I'll just say that up front. Anyway, so I bought this saw, and then I'm cruising along Amazon, and I happen to see this, what I would call a Chinese knockoff. It is, uh, it's got, the name brand is chainsaw they, they really thought a lot on that and on the bar it says chainsaw so i mean you know what it is so anyway the saws are so close to the same this has got a 2.5 uh, cc engine i think it's 2.5 25 cc engine this has got a 26 cc engine this echo has had one or two logs cut with it you know just debar or delimbing this chainsaw has not had anything done. I did not, uh, I'm not gonna bore you with putting the saw together. I did not do a video of that. It's just a chainsaw. It's, it went together just basically the same. This one has two hold bolts. This one has one. Have not, I've not had any issue with that at all. So let's quit talking about it and see uh, how they compare. All right, so this saw here, uh, it's pretty simple. It's got the little bubble here to prime it. And you, pump it three times. I really don't really know because I never read the directions. You guys don't either. I know it. Don't don't lie. On and off switch. So on and it's got a little choke here. Flips around. I don't this has been running so I don't know if we're really going to need it. Let's see. Apparently not. And the mic just went flying. <laughs> Testing one, two, three. Yep. All right. So let's try this one more time. So, you guys count one one thousand, two one thousandths. So that's got some really nice chips. Now, like I said, this is a 25cc. I don't know if I told you that or not. This is a 25cc, and that is a 26cc. So let's try the, the Chinese version here. I'm just, the build quality is not terrible. I mean, it looks about the same. Uh, well, the Echo is probably a little bit better. It's got a, the, the bubble here. It's got the chain break. And the choke is in a similar place. So we're gonna pull it out. Let's see here. This has got an on and off switch. Just like that one. That's, that's very promising. Very responsive. Let's see if it's oiling. Yep. Not oiling a lot, but it is oiling. All right. Here we go. Holy smokes, that, that's pretty impressive. Nine Honest, seconds on the first one, nine seconds on the second one. How many on the first? 12 and nine on the second. So the little Chinese saw did 12 or nine seconds and the Echo did nine, nine right? Yeah. So this one's slower. No, that one's slower. Oh, All right, we gotta do it again. Chinese so I, I got my timer over here, he's, so the, let's try it one more time. All right, by the time I touch. What we get? 11. 11 seconds. Now I will say that this has cut before today and this has not cut anything. 
but still that's pretty big and impressive. Here we go. What say you? Nine. Nine. So this one. So this is faster. Well, uh, this has got a bigger tooth on it, and it's got one more cc. Other than that, I have cut a tree down with this today. So this chainsaw is still sharp, though. I'm seeing it pull out some big chunks. This one has a bigger chain. It has a bigger, a bigger tooth. This is a low profile. This is a normal profile tooth. Making excuses, but I'm going to tell you right now, if you close your eyes, I don't think you'd know the difference. One more time. I'm gonna cut here. Let me get on this side so you guys can see it. Here we go. One, two. I don't know how this is going to hold up compared to the Echo. You know the Echo is going to hold up, but first impressions for 120 bucks, shoot, that's not bad. That's a third of the price, pretty much. All right, here we go. That's crazy. I could tell that one was faster still. Now, that time the Chinese one was nine and the Echo was seven. So here we go. The Echo was seven on this one and the Chinese was nine. The, nine, check, the Chinese one's been nine every time, right? Yeah. So it's been consistent. All right, let's do it one more time and we'll, we'll, we'll call it at that. So Echo saw first. Here we go. Maybe me holding that out from the. I think so because that was eight seconds that time. I need to let it rest only on this. So I'm gonna do one more with this, and then we'll let it rest. I'm gonna rest this on the on the front here so I know that it's not bouncing. <laughs> Try to be as fair as I can. <laughs> I think that might be an operator error. I'll take that. One more time. Here we go. I mean, this sounds really good. Well, there is different. This one's a 25 cc. This is a 26 cc. And a cc and a chainsaw, one cc is a big deal. Uh, so, well, what do you guys think? 120 bucks, 310. I don't know which one's going to hold up longer, but I'm I'm pretty impressed for the money. Uh, dang, was not expecting that. Listen, guys, if you uh, let me some comments below what you think, and if I could. I'll do some more tests on this, but you guys kind of, you know, give me what you think I need to do and I'll give it a whirl. This is just an impromptu test. Too close to call almost. Yeah. I'm impressed. I mean, but this is good. Just, just a tad higher pitch because it's a bigger engine, but yeah, but, uh, and the sound, but I mean, if you're just a homeowner and you're not, we're going to be doing it a lot. So with the longevity of the echo is important to us. If, if you're a homeowner just needing something and you need a disposable chainsaw there you go yeah there you go disposable chainsaw <laughs> you, I, you you cut all you need with it throw it away and start get you another one next week yeah, if you 
forget to service it over the winter. And it's, yeah, yeah. And yeah. Except the carburetor, just buy another one. That's a big thing with all chainsaws. I don't care what brand it is. If you leave the fuel in it over the winter, it will kill it. And it'd be a whole lot easier to eat one of these yeah. than it would these. I mean, my big saws, you know, like 600 bucks. And so I'm very, very particular about the fuel. Huh? You can get a lot of chickens with that. Get a lot of what? A lot of chickens with that. She says she can get a lot of chickens with that. We're chicken rich now, let me tell you. Anyway. What about the weights? I don't know, you gotta ask the Oh, they're really about the same. Yeah, I mean, they're literally, I mean, this one's supposed to be like a, I don't know, like a five-tenths of a pound more. I don't think it would. I, I could, you could work all day and not know the difference. Right now, probably, if you're feeling any difference, it's probably the difference in the amount of fuel. Yeah, that's true, because I just filled this one up. Honestly, I don't feel any difference. You're just too sexy for that chainsaw. <laughs> Texas Chainsaw. Can't say that. That's, I'm thinking. Let's copyright it. I'm <laughs> but if you like this kind of stuff, hit, uh, hit the subscribe button and the bell icon. That'll let you know when we put out something new. God bless. Have a great day.